Hey, what's up, guys? It's John from State Your Cause. Um, it's about day four on the uh, Graveyard of Empires tour with Evans Blue. Um, Michigan was awesome. Michigan, we played the machine shop and we played the intersection. We got to hang out with a few of our Michigan friends. That was fun. That's where we first met up with Evans Blue. Those guys are awesome. They're great people. Um, so, yeah, we've been having a blast since then. Uh, played Toledo last night. Had a pretty interesting night after that show. I'm not really going to explain it because it's funnier if our drunken selves explain it. Here it is. So tonight... Aviators. So tonight... Put on your aviators! Tonight, we decided to go to a bar after the show. Uh, the Ottawa Tavern. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to be your hip-hop hype man. Let's do this. So tonight... <laughs> <laughs> the sound guy from the show said... <laughs> we go outside and smoke a smig. Uh, they were soaking smigs. <laughs> I've been so lost since the fart, I'm sorry. Alright, alright. We were trying to go to this bar, and it was a couple days after Independence Day, and these alien spacecraft started coming down, and they kind of positioned themselves. Dude, he found like a, a countdown. Kind of Jeff Goldblum is the shit. It was Jeff Goldblum. He found it. He said, welcome to Earth. Bitch. They started firing these death rays and shit, and it just... It, it got a little hairy tonight. And then this guy pulled a hammer out. My stepson, he wished for his birthday today that I couldn't lie. I'm a lawyer. I'm a defense attorney, so it's kind of hard for me to not tell lies. All day long, I've been able to, not able to tell lies. <laughs> you were trying to tell me this pen, you were like... <laughs> Royal Blue! Royal Blue, yeah. the best thing I could do. Yeah. Alright, so, so tonight we went to a bar, and uh, the sound guy told us, Alright, we're gonna go to this bar, right after the show. Okay, that's cool. Some crazy fucking shit happened. But this guy came in to a bar after he was... <laughs> After he was starting shit before... He was mad that people were dissing skateboarding. That's right! It Skate or die! <laughs> and he you know, brings out a hammer. The hammer was in his pants. Like brings it. out a ball peen and somebody somebody was like, GUN! So we're like, get the... Nah, fucking get the fuck out of here. I'm pulling people out. Hey! Hey! hey, hey go guy. away from that place! Just keep rolling. Go! Keep going! Keep rolling. I trust you! What was it? Like, eight cops? Eight cops. Nine, Nine cops. It was ten? Yeah. One left. Five squad cars and one undercover car. Who skate went? or die, man. <laughs> you all gonna die because you don't skate. When he, when he first started the fight over skateboarding, <laughs> he was talking about this guy named Jesus. And all these people were like, a badass. You got, Zeus. You got yeah, a problem Zeus. with Jesus? Where the problem with fucking Jesus? Right now. I'm playing everybody in this fucking bar. I said, look man, skateboarding is great. I love skateboarding too. I'm, I got my skateboard in the trailer. And then he walked inside and he pulled a hammer out on people and he got knocked out. Pierce is the guy's yeah. name, right? Pierce. He, buddy. he told me specifically like that he used a right to plant your left foot and then you stick him, stick him, stick, stick, stick him. Wait, I witnessed through, that. He, he said, did say that. If you're smart, you don't hit people with your knuckles. But I guess he wasn't smart, so he just stuck the dude with his fist and his down like a ton of bricks. And Earlier on in the night, the guy, after he is fighting with these guys, he walks away and he's like, all right, man, whatever, whatever. <laughs> totally hammered with a beer in his hand. Hops in the car, hammer, and he comes back. Sets the beer down and just starts driving away. Just <laughs> you see this shit? <laughs> yeah, That's because you're not. That's because you're not trying hard enough. That's because you have a shitty attitude. Is there like right it, now, might, so. it may or may not be? I was hoping you could try. Our beers were on a curb, sitting privately, waiting on us to come back and attend to them. Yeah. All in all. It was a very fantastic, eventful night. And for now sure. we're here at Walmart. We're here at Walmart, about to crash out. Good night. Good night. Now here's a clip of James humping me on stage. So this is the new tour van, and it has air conditioning, and that is amazing because this tour is hot as. F we're staying at our dude Ron's house tonight. Uh, he's the owner of A Logo T. Um, the company that did our shirts today. Uh, the shirts look amazing. 
Um, here's a picture now. So those are the new shirts. Uh, we'll have them this whole tour. We're coming through Dayton. So all you McGuffey's fans um, that have been asking us when are we getting new shirts, uh, we'll finally have them. So uh, be prepared for that. I just want to go ahead and say thanks to all you guys for your support, for your kind words, for your help. It really means a lot on this tour. What's up, guys? It's Moss from State Your Cause. Uh, we're going to show you guys a couple videos of the uh, first part of the tour. Uh, it's been really awesome so far, so I hope you guys enjoy this, and we look forward to seeing your comments. Take care. SYC ain't nothing to fuck with. SYC ain't nothing to fuck with. SYC ain't nothing to fuck with. Get out of bed, motherfucker, on the bus. On the bus. On the bus, motherfucker, on the bus. If I ask you, would you want to? 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 If